An attempt at traffic stop turns to chaos as two Shelby County Sheriff's deputies vehicles are damaged by a suspect attempting to escape. Good evening. I'm Stephanie Skurlock and I'm Greg Hirsch. Deputies eventually caught 19 year old Salim Wilkins, who was named in a warrant for carjacking. WRG Shea Arthur is live tonight to explain how deputies tracked him down. Shea, what do you know? Hey, Greg. Hey, Stephanie. Well, tonight, while Wilkins faces a long list of charges, those deputies initially tried to arrest him in a fast food drive through. But as you're going to see in a second here, that didn't go so well. In this Hickory Hill McDonald's drive through Shelby County deputies say they spotted a stolen Kia right around the lunch hour yesterday afternoon. Detectives now say 19 year old Salim Wilkins, along with two other men, were inside the car. When a deputy attempted to stop the car, the driver of the stolen Kia took off through the parking lot, but not before scratching one sheriff's cruiser and colliding with a second one. From there, it became a chase. The three men inside the car bailing out, taking off running. Deputies were able to catch up to Wilkins and detain him. Inside a backpack he was carrying, they say they found marijuana, a gun, and a mechanic glove. Deputies on scene believe the glove to be a burglary tool as it was located during the recovery of a stolen car. Records show Wilkins was wanted in a carjacking case from a week ago. We checked. Wilkins has been arrested on robbery cases in the past, but charges appear to have been dropped. We also stopped by his listed address to see if someone could speak to us about him, but no one came to the door. Stephanie Gregg, so far no word tonight on those other two men believed to be involved in that case. Of course, if you know anything, call Crime Stoppers at number 901-528-CASH. We're live downtown tonight. Shay Arthur, WREG News Channel 3.